Hi, this is Joachim for statisticsglobe.com and in this video I will show you how to add a new element to a list in the R programming language. So in the video I'm going to show you an example and this example is based on the list that we can create with line 2 of the code. So if you run this line of code you will see that a new list object appears at the top right of RStudio and we can also have a look at this list by running line 3 of the code. And then you will see at the bottom in the RStudio console that our list consists of two list elements, L1 and L2. Now, for the example, we also need to create an element that we can add to this list later on. And this is what we do with line 6 of the code. So if you run this line of code, you will see that at the top right of RStudio, a new vector object appears, which is called myElement. And we can have a look at this element by running line 7 of the code. And then you can see at the bottom in the RStudio console that our example element contains three characters. Now let's assume that we want to add this vector as third element to our already existing list. Then we can apply the code that you can see in line 10. And in this line of code, we are using the C function. And within the C function, we are specifying the name of our list. So in this case, our list is called my list. Then we are using a comma. And then afterwards, we are specifying the name of the new list element. So in this case, we will call our new list element L3. And this list element is equal to our new element, which we have called my element. And around this element, we are wrapping the list function again. So if you run line 10 of the code, you will see that at the top right of our studio, a new list object is created. And we can have a look at this new list by running line 11 of the code. And then you will see at the bottom in the RStudio console that our new list contains of exactly the same list elements as our original list plus the values of our element and this element or this new list element is called L3. So in this video you have learned how to add a new element to a list in the R programming language. However, in case you want to learn more on this topic, you could check out my homepage statisticsglobe.com because on the homepage I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail and I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video. Furthermore, if you have liked the video, I would be very happy if you leave me some positive feedback in the comments and make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notifications in future when I'm releasing new videos to the channel. That's it for this video. Thanks a lot. See you next time.